Welcome back, everybody, to the Matt Pierre Madden 18 Career Mode Series. We're in Matt's second year, and we're taking on the New England Patriots today. A week after, perhaps, one of the most exciting episodes of the series. I know Matt Pierre didn't have a monumental game by any standards, but the offense as a whole played extremely well. Andrew Luck came back, three touchdowns to T.Y. Hilton, and now we're taking on the Patriots and trying to renew a rivalry here in Week 2. All right, can the Colts keep it going? We were spectacular back in week one, and the offense has never looked like that in this series. Now we're up against the New England Patriots, but we're going to need another great offensive day to get this second win. Now I looked through a lot of the goals you guys had for Matt Pierre in the comments section on the last episode. A lot of you think you can put up some bigger rushing stats this year. As we try to get to the outside, there's Trey Flowers limiting him to no gain. But what I want to see Matt hit this year is 1,400 rushing yards, and I want to see 2,000 yards from scrimmage. Now, to get to 1,400 rushing, he needs 60 or uh, 87 and a half yards per game as T.Y. comes here with the 17-yard reception. So Matt got 80 or so in week one. So if we're around 80 yards every game and get a few hundreds, we're going to be in good shape. First and 10. Matt here cutting outside and getting to about the 41 yard line. Good run. I also saw some of you like seeing me work LeGarrette Blunt into the mix as well. Short yardage stuff and to give Matt a little rest. I'll probably continue to do that, but still get Matt his touches. Here we go around the outside. Up the sideline goes Matt Pierre for a 41 yard touchdown. Trying to get Matt outside to get some bigger plays, and we got one here early. Let's watch this back here as we run the stretch. Good job here by Cameron Brait, helping give us a chance to get to the outside. Dorsett and Hilton do a good job. Then a bad angle taken here by number 30, that's Deron Harmon. And Matt Pierre doesn't have blazing speed, but enough if you play like that. Well, we're off to a good start here. 49 yards already, we reach one goal. And Matt had his second touchdown on the season. Now, New England did get a touchdown, and they made the extra point. That's a nice concept. But we, uh, we missed ours, so we're down one here as Dorsett gets a few. Trying to convert the third down. New England will bring five, and we got T.Y. once again. His numbers were way down last season, and I just... I like this start he's putting together over 200 yards back in week one. He can put up some fantastic numbers this season. Let's get the ball back in the hands of Matt Pierre. Great pulls around, and we're going to get about five, six. Matt, of course, did have the fumble last week, so I know that's on everybody's mind. Not sure how many fumbles this year, but I'm hoping that the numbers are cut at least in half from his rookie season. On the bottom ticker there, I just saw that Jarek McKinnon and Teddy Bridgewater are both on the Jets. That's an interesting move they made there. That's down the middle. I thought I was lucked there for a second, ready to throw the football. I was so confused. Apparently that last pass was incomplete. I thought it was a catch. So here's third and nine, trying to extend the possession. And look goes down. Sacked by Lawrence Guy, and the drive comes to an end. I think New England hit a 70-yard touchdown or something. I'll have to check the numbers as they extend their lead 14-6. Let me make a correction here. It was actually a 93-yard touchdown. Who do you think scores a 93-yard touchdown on the Patriots? Maybe Brandon Cooks? No. Rob Gronkowski somehow went 93 yards for a score. So we're down by eight, and we got the first down catch made here by Brian Quick. We've gotten to the 35-yard line. Third down here. Need five. And Luck hits quick. That is a catch. Well done there at the sideline. They've been accounting for Matt Pierre on every play so far, so they're not giving him any wide-open looks until... Oh, come on! How does that go behind him? Third and nine now. We are in field goal range. Luck going to take a shot up the same week. What? He dropped it. Dorsett couldn't contain it. 
Come on, man. I thought Luck threw this a bit too quick, but I mean, Dorsett's fast, so he gets down the field in a hurry. And the throw is on the money, keeping it away from the defenders. But he just can't secure it all the way. So now it's a 14-9 game. We get a little bit closer. And we'll get Matt Pierre up the middle, but not much there. Third and five now from the 36. Matt's wide open. Got to hit him here. Wow, great play by Malcolm Butler to keep Pierre shy of the sticks. Eight-point game now, and we're approaching halftime. Trying to get some points before the break. And that is wide open. Give Luck all kinds of time, and that's what happens. We do have all three timeouts right now. I want to try surprising him here with a draw. So let's get Matt Pierre the football, and he's dragged down after a short gain. Staying to help protect this time. Luck, not sure he needs the extra protection. Nice pass to Cameron Brait. Timeout. Bringing the safety down here. He's blitzing. Matt's open. Got to hit him there, but a flag on the play as Pierre sprints up the sideline. But is this going to stand? Hoping for defensive holding here. What are we going to get? Don't show my offensive lineman. It's on us, isn't it? Holding on Jack Muhort negates a Matt Pierre touchdown. Thanks, Jack, for that one. Second down and 20. And we're going to get a little bit closer, but now it's going to be tough to get points. Third and 14. Can we get a bit closer for Benetieri? Luck. Laser. Got it to T.Y. And out of bounds or incomplete? Oh, he out of bounds. Matt missed the play and we got closer to the end zone. All right. We could perhaps tie this game before halftime. Matt to the outside. Wide open. T.Y. blocks for him. That's a touchdown. There we go, the Patriots got lazy in covering Matt Pierre. So he's taking full advantage, and we're in a two-point game. And here we go in the second half. 17 to 15, Vinatieri missed his second extra point of the ball game. And luck, oh, that was not the best decision. Matt Pierre, two touchdowns on the day against the Patriots. He makes the catch here on second down to keep the chains moving. Now, we haven't asked Luck to air it out yet. T.Y.'s been a little quieter, so we're going to take a shot here on first down. Matt tries to help. Intercepted Dante Hightower. Look, panicked under pressure, and the Patriots will take over. So the aggressive call doesn't work for us. Now we're down by nine points. We'll try to toss it out and quickly get upfield to not lose any yardage. Matt's having a solid day, though. A lot of yards already on a fair amount of touches. What is that, Andrew? This is not the same Andrew Luck we saw back in week one that was lighting up the scoreboard. What's going on today? Everything changes here in New England. Andrew now to the sideline. And yeah, we're, we've been playing it pretty close to the sideline all day. And this time it doesn't work. And now the Patriots are beginning to pull away. They have doubled up our score, 30-15. to 15. And Luck hits quick on the outside for a first. Look at this aggressive look here from the Patriots. And they were bluffing. Luck hits great. Tackled by Hightower. We have passed the ball quite a bit today. I didn't know how unbalanced we were. And Luck. Man, that's close. And they're going to call that out of bounds as well. Patriots score in one play. So the defense not playing as well as they did back in week one. New England, I, I don't know who scored this long touchdown this time. As Matt Pierre gets out to the 30. Well, this time it was Brandon Cooks on a 79-yard punt return for a touchdown. So down 37-15, to 15, need big plays in the passing game, and Luck has a first to Dorsett. Probably going to have to throw it the rest of the way. First and 10. Come on, Luck. Get it outside. No, he overthrows his receiver. 
Showing blitz again here. Going to keep Matt in as they only rush four. And look off of TY's hands. We are just not executing this week. We go from making very few mistakes to a whole bunch of them. First and ten. Lux going deep for TY this time. He has it broken up. What a play downfield. That was a, a big time pass deflection. So a big pass breakup by Devin McCourty. Now it's third down and five. Matt to the flats. Nope, he's not open. Look, is sacked, and the Patriots have dominated third down in this game. Fourth and 12 here in desperation mode. Flying up the sideline is Matt Pierre. Luck heaving downfield. Nope, incomplete for Brait. Another incompletion. As a team, we still have a lot of work to do, and this game definitely proves that. Nowhere near what we did back in week one. Second down for Luck. There's the lob. That time we got a catch. There's Brait. Trying to at least finish strong in this game. Get Matt some stats. Got this. Get the block, Matt. Hurdle McCordy or try to. Good attempt. Just three and a half minutes left to go now. First down. Lux just not on his game today. And the offense has taken a major step back. I'd say Matt did well, though. But Luck is just not playing good. Second and ten for Andrew Luck. As he steps up, fires and misses once again. That time it could have been a touchdown. What's wrong with Andrew Luck today? Try it again on third down now. Hey, that time we got it. I thought he was going to throw it to Matt, though, in the end zone. We could have had a nice aggressive catch or something. Here's the 45th pass attempt upcoming for Andrew Luck. If he throws it, that is. And he's not sacked by Lawrence Guy. Luck to the air again and intercepted in the end zone. A dreadful day for Andrew Luck in a game that we all want to come to an end. Man, a huge disappointment against the New England Patriots. And Matt started off this game pretty well. He had a big touchdown and another one later down the road. But ever since that failed play action shot that was intercepted by Hightower it was all downhill and the Patriots run away with the game dominating the, the game on special teams defense and offense complete domination so Tom Brady only had to pass 25 times today and still threw for more yards than Andrew Luck and five touchdowns a near flawless game from Tom Brady and 100 yards from James White so Matt Pierre gave us 70 on the ground, along with another 51 and a score in the air. Good day for Matt, but he was one of the only Colts that really did well in this game. We reached a lot of fantasy goals today, but they're not really worth much XP. I'm not sure if I should edit the uh, XP sliders. Let me know in the comment section if you think that would be a good idea. I haven't really thought about that much for this series, but it might make sense. I do have a few points here, and I'm going to probably upgrade carrying plus one and awareness plus one. 76 overall now at 24 years old. The numbers for Matt now look like this. 153 in two games and a 76.5 yard average. If he were to average that over the course of the entire season, that would bring him to 1224. So a bit under where we want to be for Matt Pierre this season. But he does already have 86 in the air. And another touchdown receiving. So things are going alright so far for Matt Pierre. But hopefully the offense as a whole and the team can bounce back next time out. Andrew Luck's got a lot to prove after that terrible performance. But at least we have an opponent that might struggle a little bit. It is the New York Jets. Now led by Teddy Bridgewater. But they are 0-2 on the season. What's going on there in New York? I want to see their roster. Did they upgrade the defense? Who are we playing against next time? First of all, there's Teddy at 81 overall. But the defense has players. Leonard Williams, of course. Sheldon Richardson. They have lost Muhammad Wilkerson, it would appear. Uh, Mario Bird is intriguing here. And I already saw not much at cornerback, so... 
This is the type of matchup where the entire offense should be able to bounce back. But can we do it? We shall find out next time in the Matt Pierre Career Mode series. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the episode. That will do it for this one. Please leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave your feedback in the comment section. And subscribe to the channel for much more on the way. And check out more of the content here on this channel and my main channel at youtube.com slash Have a great day, everybody, and I'll see you next time.